Now the Clark Summit area was also hit hard by this weekend storm. And that's where we find 2822 City Costas this morning, where many road closures are in place right now. City, good morning. Good morning, Tom and Kelly. At crews have been working around the clock across the county trying to reopen some of these roads that were shut down following this weekend's storms. You can take a look right behind me. This road closure is in place here on Northern Boulevard at Layton Road and Holgate Street. Now, of course, throughout the morning, we're seeing more traffic, but many of those vehicles getting turned around on the detour route up late in road. There is one gas station open that is open to local traffic, of course, but this business right on the corner, you can see some sandbags still right outside that door, seeing some of that flooding damage that they did sustain over the weekend. Now the severity of damage caused by the heavy downpours caught many people off guard. On Sunday, the Lackawanna County commissioners authorized a declaration of disaster emergency due to Saturday's storms. The aftermath from the storm led to the closure of the Wright Center for Community Health's Clark Summit location due to flooding damage. The water was so intense it even caused pumps to fail, flooding basements and homes as well as a local restaurant in the middle of their dinner rush. The owner of Armetta's Restaurant and Pizza says they lost everything stored in their basement, including equipment and food, but the property was keeping the excuse me, the priority was keeping everyone safe. It just came out of nowhere. It, it was raining and the next thing you know, it it was like a, like the ocean just it was coming in from all different angles and we all just tried to work together we had customers inside we were trying to stay as calm as possible in the water to not get to them The owner of Armetta's says they will be closed indefinitely as they work to repair, of course, that damage sustained in the storm. Now, coming up later on 2822 News, we'll be following all of these road closures still put in place, especially here on Northern Boulevard. PennDOT officials, as long as officials with the Shapiro administration, will be holding a press conference later this morning in Dunmore. Stay with us as we continue to follow this storm damage. Back to you guys. Thanks, Sydney. And